Kevin Frankie's second police interrogation has now been released. In this clip, Kevin shares how he and Ruby initially got involved in Jody Hildebrand's Connections Network, and it's very revealing. Jody always had a larger interest in um, communicating with the parents more than with the actual patient, which I always found curious. Um, but her theory was, if, if you want to help your child, you have to help yourself first, and then you'll know how to help the child. So she spoke with Ruby frequently. It, it got strange around the, the fall of 2020. The Hannahs were trying to convince and bring Ruby into... Um, Hi. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Into this um, organization called Connections, and um, that particularly were focused on things like lust versus love, and, and healthy marriages, happier marriages, happier relationships. Um, she invited me to go to a. Um, it was like a conference or something held at Thanksgiving Point. Um, in Lehigh, and my impression at that time was this is this is absolute craziness. This is a bunch of man-hating women that are just looking for excuses to you know, tear down their husbands, and I mean that's what it felt like to me when I was in there. It, but it did it was confusing because there were people that I respected a lot that were up on the stage with microphones in hand, you know giving testimonials of how great this was and how it changed their lives and their marriage and like the Hannahs were among them, you know, and then, and, and so, yeah, it was confusing. And for two hours, Ruby very emotionally just shared how she felt in our marriage and how the things that I, um, over 20 years of marriage, you know, asking for sex as a husband frequently or, um, asking her to wear lingerie or, or things like that, how that made her feel. And it was really emotional and it touched me. Like, I, I didn't realize that she felt so strongly about that, that she felt so hurt by that. And so I committed that I would really give it a go. And I stayed in the men's group. And so, you know, in that men's group, I met with Jody every week. 